This is the uh, annual conference sponsored by the New York State Society of Professional Engineers, where engineers from all over the state attend for two days of lectures to get credit to renew their license. And I uh, spoke on the first day for six hours, and they get six credit hours, and I was voted the most outstanding speaker in the history of these conferences. And here I am uh, starting to address the group. They're all electricians. They want to have their own business. You can't go into business without that license. So they took a little pity on me. When I wrote my book, this is the book. Okay, here I'm showing uh, the book I wrote 30 years ago on security. And here is published this year on a catalog that lists hundreds of books on security, terrorism, closed circuit TV, and security general topics. But when I published my book 30 years ago, there was no catalog. That was the entire publishing market. One book, I wrote the first one in the area of security in 1984. I hired me to write a textbook, and that was when I was teaching at Jersey City. So I wrote this, took me a year to write it. And McGraw Hill, nobody had ever published something, made that clear. Now we're, we're going to go to the uh, end of the seven hour lecture and I end all my lectures with teaching the art of lot picking to the audience and within five minutes my audience is going to practice lot picking and they can pick any lock in the building where the conference or any conference is held and here's a man that came up an engineer came up out of the audience and I'm going to show him how to pick a lock using a lock pick and a wrench, they call it. In other words, you cannot pick a lock with one tool. You got to have two. The pick that puts the pins up and down without getting too complicated. Then you got to have something, a tension bar or a wrench to turn it. In other words, when you use a regular key, when you put the key in a slot, the door doesn't open. You have to turn it, and that takes a second part. And I'm going to have every student in the class, every every man, come up and actually pick the locks. And of course, I sell lock sets for $15, and usually half the audience buys them. Why, I don't know. But the first five, I always give the address of the local appliance stores where they can practice at night and uh, practically steal something. And if they get caught, they can always tell the cop that they're doing homework for this professional engineering uh, lecture. And here's the man who's gonna sit there and take this pick and then put it in the slot and bounce it up and down and then he's going to turn it. Now, now listen to watch. I'll stop talking. Just watch it. He can't turn it and pick Thank <laughs> you. 